Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are continuing on part 14 of Tabby's journey through Baldur's Gate 3. As you might remember from my last video, I had a very epic battle where I didn't think about it and I killed them all. I've now unlocked the secret to the game. <laughs> Not really. Probably can do a bit more strategic than I did. I think it was all based off of luck. I did say in this episode we might not go straight back to the goblin camp. I think we are going to go and actually get Witters first. And then see if there's maybe any other quests around that area. Because while we dealt with Princess Gut, I think dealing with the drow is going to be a bit harder. So let's jump straight back into it. So we're still at the camp, so if I remembered correctly, I think it's maybe the overgrown ruins that we'll go back to. We'll find out, yeah. Oh, no. Well, I mean, we can go this way. To get to Wishers, I know there's a few ways, but we were actually over here. No, we don't want the custom marker. Uh, so I think that's where we're just going to go back to and go that way. Could probably try to break into there. Oh, newborn. Gone and not forgotten. Wherever he may be. We may come across him again in the future. We can only hope. Will I try to... How delicious. Let's see. Look, there's no harm. See if we can go in this way. Interesting. What can you do, my friend? A it is locked. Touch. And let's add a bonus. I mean, difficulty class is 20. You'd be hoping with all of this now, yet again, if he gets a natural one, we're not getting in anywhere. Oh, with everything, I think we'll just meet us. Yep, yeah, very good. And in we go. I'm assuming, guessing, oh, this is possibly another way into him. Now we can disarm the traps, but no one stopped me yet. I think we just oh don't walk into it. Come back! <laughs> they are so reckless. We'll just try to get none of them to stand on it. Actually, I'm going to cast... Control. Yeah, I'm going to cast Speak with Animals on herself. Poor Tabby is failing all the perception checks. This place is trapped. Yeah, there's a lot of them, isn't there? Don't waste a step. Very good. I mean, look, really, I'm not going to really look around here, I'll be honest. Oh, don't. And we'll just see, can we just get in here? No perception checks yet that we failed. Go up this way, we'll see. Gilded chest. Protection. Oh, yeah, we will take that. Jog, light that. It's just light and everything, I think, is just a good way. It's just in case we are... Seems simple enough. Sometimes when there's more light, you'll notice more with, say, checks and stuff like that. It'll make it easier for you to find stuff. Take all them, because I like collecting everything. Try this door. That is locked. Watch your back. Yes, come on, my friend. Simple. Let's see, can you get in here? Ten. Yet again, we should meet this unless it's a natural one. Just with all of these alone. We will see though. Natural twenty. They don't even need to add everything else. I would have liked to have seen them do it because I would have liked to have seen how high we could have gotten. Oh, yeah. yeah, very good. And we're back in two. Where Wishers is. Can. Can 
Can I pick him up? Oh. <laughs> uh, okay. That's one way of doing it. I actually thought I was going to put him into my bag or something. That's why I, I was trying to pick him up. No problem. We were going to have to kill them anyway. Great haste. Down you go. And bonus. No real bonus. Let's have some carnage. Yes, let's indeed, my friend. Let's get you to cunny hide. And now. Sneak attack. 90%. Very good. That's another one. This is already so much easier. This is my time. And I'm not going to jinx myself. But this already seems so much easier than the first time came in here. Uh, ooh, is that a cantrip? Very nice. Yeah, let's do it. 85%. Oh, very good. We like that. Fleet of foot. What about your bonus? Hex. So actually, I think what I possibly should be doing is putting Hex down first. Even though, is that... It is, it's not a cantrip. So we will not, I'm not going to use that. Go over here going. and... Oh, uh... Handcast, not proficient with weapons on our... Hmm, i guessing that is what I have her actually equipped with. Can you change... Can we change it here? I mean, I'm assuming we can't put this... Well, we might be able to put it on mid-battle. I'm just assuming it's possibly something to do with that. Because uh, if I go to items again... I mean, I'm pretty sure she had a shield the last time, which is fine. Yeah, I mean, that is her own one that she had anyway. Look, I'm going to put it down to... It was to do with the, the armor I had on. Because it was heavy. She wears medium. Not a whole lot else we can do here, actually, now by the looks of it. So, probably look changing the clothes was an action. Am I even going to bother? Look, no harm. And turn. I'm not too worried about this yet again. Probably sh shouldn't be jinxing myself. Now she is silent, so we really want to try to hit that guy over there. Now she can't. She won't have any melee, so. We're going to just attack this guy ourselves. Can you feel death's cold grip? I'm going to just get a normal just 72 oh, disadvantage. Now. Why disadvantaged? I'm not sure, but look. Even... Okay, that's good. Look, it's just to have gotten the... The actual oh, concentration the spell off. Oh. Oh, he must have saved it. So he really can't do anything. Flourish. Possibly. Oh, no harm. That'll be with the weapon he is using, which is, yeah, a rapier. So I... Oh, there's two types of melee weapons. I can never remember the name. There is one, say, so like that. Um... Right here. It like it has a flourish to it. I think daggers could be the same as well. I could be wrong. It's more they're like they're kind of fancy. You can do fancier moves. You have like a flourish with it. Um I can't remember there is a name on them. Whereas you can imagine, like, say with a great axe. That's a swing and a hit. You know, it's all there's weight behind it. Whereas there's other ones like that that are more kind of artsy, we'll say. Can he... Um, he can do... I know we may as well while we're at it. Yep. So that's two. And we'll end that Can't turn. Give up. 
And tricksters, yeah, we can't really do. I start dashing over to him. I mean, maybe no harm. She probably will do get opportunity attacks. So we might just actually deal with this one that we have here anyway and just melee it in that turn. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have to... Oh, never mind. Thank you for coming that slight bit closer. That's what we wanted. Can't reach. Try with him. And that did not work. That is okay in that turn. I don't mind if he gets an opportunity. He didn't even get an opportunity attack. That's very good. Now, let's try to get you. And dead. So now silenced. Down. On the victor's path. And we can properly, properly hit him now. Am I too close for that? Yeah, I was thinking I may be. Vicious Mockery. Torn Whip. 55. <laughs> Let's do the Vicious Mockery. Oh, what a burn. <laughs> you won't like that. Shove him while you're at it. Go on. Way. <laughs> Yeah, you didn't like that now, did you? Oh, what a burn. Oh, no, no. <laughs> I played myself. Can Can't you go down this way? I, yeah, she won't be able to see him from there. No problem. In that turn. One. Oh, it's going to say run past her and she get an opportunity attack. Now, was there... Oh, we killed them already. Can she see him, I wonder? What if I... No, she can't. Very well. But if we run over this way, and yes, critical miss. Let's spill some blood. That's fine. We will running dash, which is a oh. No. I think it's still on him. That's okay. This way. And. Can we do it, Pearson? Yes. Yeah. Very good. This is my time. This is your no time. time to waste. Come over here now and Eldritch Blast this guy. One. Way. Oh no, base. Need to act fast. You can. No point in us doing too much. He shouldn't last long with all of us here. Yet again, we may as well just fly through this. There's no point in getting too bogged down in what we're doing. Five end. And... Here's an... Oh, that's a short rest. No problem, we'll just normal main hand attack. And there we go. See what I mean about the audio? Don't mind if I do. Sometimes it's so loud. I know that's like their chatter, as they call it, so it won't be that loud, but... The audio in this game is just slightly, slightly all over the place is the only thing. Take all that. So, a lot easier this time around. When you consider what it was like at the start. This is part of... Oh, well, I mean, obviously this game, but D&D &D itself as well. The higher you get, the easier things kind of get. Just with the fact that you'll have higher health. All right. You have more spells. Like, usually when I start a new campaign in Dungeons and Dragons. Moving. And you're back at level one. You are closer to a full, like, party wipe at that level one than at a higher level. And you will be up against, say, enemies that are maybe a level one as well, or maybe two. Because there could be, like, four or five of you in the party, but... The chances of you dying are so much higher than when you're at a higher level. And it's all due to that simple fact of you have not a whole lot of spells... Your health is super, super low at the start. I mean, I could be wrong. I think with my own druid when she first started, I think her health was like 
10. So you can imagine if you have an enemy that even gets a crit and they get like double damage. You're kind of, you could be done there and then. Depending on what they are. No one back home will ever believe this. No, this time we are going to get Tavi to speak to him. We won't rob his stuff just yet. Let's have a chat with him first. Oh wait, where is he? Oh no. Here lies the guardian of tombs. Through knowledge comes atonement. Oh, maybe it's because I killed all them first. He's not there. Oh. She'd mind my step. Well, I don't know where we're going to find. <laughs> I don't know where we're going to find him now. Oh, wizards. I'm so sorry. Are you sure you're not inside? I, I'll be honest, I was not expecting that. I definitely thought we would find him in there. Such is life, we tried. Now who would be better to speak to the dead? I think he might be for some reason. He's kind of a warlock, so kind of seems more their realm, maybe. It's a finesse weapon. That's the word I was trying to think of. It's a finesse. Doesn't say what that is, but with the finesse weapons, that you have more of a flourish. Artsy, fancier than a normal weapon, basically. So that's why he just had a few more moves that he could have done. He is light armor as well. Show helmet. Oh, I thought I might kind of make things easier. Or I thought it might, you know, show. Oh, you can put this on instead. But you can't, so. Long sword. There doesn't seem to be a whole lot more I can give him at the moment. Or these, like, ring slots. Ring. Helmet, shoulders, maybe gloves. Uh, oh, he can level up. Let's level you up. So I don't know why it's just him. Maybe he's had more final blows. I'm not sure. So what will we pick for you? Oh, these are the ones that are available. I mean... Charm person, up to a combined. I think this might be the easiest one. Uh, you increase ability by two. The feats usually kind of take me a bit of time to figure out what to get, basically. What would suit him, though? Dungeon Delver. Kind of anything sneaky really would be good for him. Sharpshooter. Ritual. Oh, this is... This is going to be kind of hard. Your movement speed increases. So that might be a good one, actually. For him. Lucky. Lucky is kind of good too. Alert is always a nice one. You know what? I think I'm going to go with alert. It's kind of nice great. to have. At least I'll always have someone in the group that cannot be surprised. He can maybe, you know, even take uh, a shot first and he will genuinely, because, I mean, he's getting plus five to initiative. He'll probably always be top of the round. 
Very but yet well again, then. lots of D and D heads here. Completely get that. When you go into a battle, everyone rolls their twenty-sided die, and that determines what position you are going to go in the battle. So just like you see in the game here, you know when it does be up top here, it has all the names and who's going where. Obviously, whoever gets the highest, like you roll your die, you'll also have an initiative number, I think is the best way to describe it. Obviously, whoever has the highest between you and the enemies gets to go first. So, him having that obviously means that Quiet. he's more than likely, oh no, don't he's more than likely going to always go top of the round. So even against the enemies, he should be first. Hmm. Does it open? Let's light some candles and see, can we figure out? Maybe there is, like, a, a trap thing I can... Hit? No? Not getting any perception rolls anyway. That, like this. Oh. Yeah, I was thinking as much. This place is falling apart. Could have happened by itself. No such thing as coincidences when there's loot to be had. Okay. Okay. <laughs> F5, F5 at first. <laughs> <laughs> uh, will we do it? I do it. Are we? Can we all hide? See, he's gone top of the round again because of the. I do, well, it could be because he got a surprise attack on them, but I'd be I'll thinking it it's way. more to do with the initiative now. I know exactly who I want because I don't know if you remember. <laughs> I remember this only Feel too well. I he's a barbarian, and he is going to rage very quickly, and it's not fun when he rages. I'll be honest; he completely wiped poor. Well, actually, he wiped the whole team the first time, including Tavi. So we want to get rid of him as quickly as we possibly can. Can we... If I go here... The other thing I don't want to do is to block the doorway, which is possibly going to happen next. Yeah, Pat is interrupted. It's because he is in... the way. Can I... Can I go past him? We're not going to be able to get past him. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I just closed the door. <laughs> <laughs> Until I can get him to move. I mean, unless we shove him, I don't really want to shove him. Oh! <laughs> Sorry, it's locked. We're in here. Has, has, eat, has, eat. He just, he just jumped straight in. No problem. Um, kind of vampire bite you first. Yeah, there we go. You shouldn't have done that. And I was going to say, I'll hide, but he's not going to be able to hide. Yeah. But can I hamstring? I mean, oh, I do like, oh, disadvantaged. What about you? Are you, you're disadvantaged too. But... Hideous laughter on you. Ah, saved. We tried. Imagine if these take me out now. Oh, she's still hidden though. Good woman, Shadowheart. Oh, oh, very good. Can heal myself with that. What are we going to do here then? Let me see. Yes. So, don't want to really waste any of my spells, I'll be honest. Too close. Let's try hit him. 
five. Good. Yep. Battle In turn. Yet again. Not too worried. You don't want to. Don't want to. Um. Jinx myself. But. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that, that wasn't a great insult. Um. Yeah, good try, Will. Good try. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm just... We're gonna fly through this. Pick things quick. Can't remember now. How do I get Shadowheart into the battle? Maybe I don't even want her in the battle. I mean, if they all... If they... Yeah, see, him raging is... I think is when he's raging as well. What will actually probably happen. He will... How do I say this? He, I think he takes half damage on, and he, well, yeah, sorry, yeah, makes sense. He takes half damage. Yes. But can, will the point, oh yeah, he got, did he hit him? He may have hit him. Got an opportunity attack. I was kind of hoping the poison spray would hit a few of them. Can I? Oh, <laughs> I didn't think it would work. Um, he is out in the open, but look, what can we do? Oh, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh, this might not go down too well. We might have to start thinking a bit. Okay, let's see. We definitely want to get ragey done, like, ASAP. I'll be honest. Um, Twenty percent. Oh, they're just they're too close. Probably do need to get Shadowheart in here somehow. Oh look, I think she's gonna be put. Yeah, she's actually in now this time. So can I bone it? Can I do it on the star? Get that patched up. Yeah, very good. We still have the opportunity now to hit. If I thunder wave, thunder wave. Mm, that's blocked. Torn whip. Look, this torn whip. And see what happens. Yeah, one. On the victor's path. That's a bonus action. Oh, do I? I don't know how many of them I get. It's a level two. So I'll only get two of them. So that's why, I mean, I really don't want to go take only half. That's an action though. That is also an action. Bonus action is hex. And that's at level one, but these are level two doesn't grant any additional benefits. It doesn't say, I can't remember if I can cast it. I don't think I can cast it and it not use it. Look, I know he's, it's the pure fact, oh. I, okay. We didn't kill one of our own, which is good. I'm ready. But he now, Dark One's blessed and he should, yeah, get held basically for killing someone it's only temporary hit points but he should get them i mean sacred flame 36 that's 50 he's raging let's let's try it okay good he's just he's the main damage hitter so it's good that we have him down we need everyone alive yeah heal because he's out in the open here with freedom, opportunity attack, very good. Ah, they went for inside instead. Right, let's try and cunning hide. Don't know if that's working, we'll find out. <laughs> it is not working. <laughs> and I am going to... Don't want to use all of his spells. Happy, oh, they're not going to be happy for long. Let's try seven. Quite nice. 
No bonus. We'll end. Five. Five. Ten. We can come out though and help. Oh, can't reach destination. Now, if I jump though, can I jump? Because, I mean, the other lad jumped in. I'm out of all my healing spells. Yes. Oh, I can heal myself. Yet again. Don't necessarily want to use oh, everything just yet. Forever dauntless. Get you to jump out to my friend. Can you jump there? And. 64. 570. Yes, again, we just want to start. Yeah. Working them out. And if I move him here, he might take. They might hit him instead of Astarian, which we kind of want now at this stage. Sacred Flame. 40 40. 50 50. Let's try. Miss. Going to put this on him. And. Now, try to hide. Don't, don't know if it's working. Is it working? No, it's not working. That is okay. Still gonna ranged attack. Ranged attack, 70. Six. End. Fast, fast, fast. Oh. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> no. Okay, wasn't necessarily planning on that happening. <laughs> Which is, of course, always the way you don't plan on any of this happening. Oh, no. Give me a second. Let, let me think about this. Let me think about this. Put down concentration spell first. Where is it? There we go. But I can't move it. But let's do it. Now, I mean, unless... You know what? Let's not wild shape. You got this, girl. You definitely don't, but let's see. Oh. Christ, he's dead, dead. Um, do you have a scroll or a vivify? Now, let's heal and ward ourselves again. Can I move my moonbeam? Now we can move our moonbeam, which we very, very much like. Not enough movement, but I'm going to move it here. In case she decides to come back, because I can now... I can maybe help these up. There. Very good. All right, come on. Up you get. Okay, he's dead too. Uh, scroll of revivify. Back up you go. Yes, I know it did. Don't worry, we'll have you back up. Yeah, <laughs> we will. Don't worry. Uh... We can, and I think we'll use both our short wrists. And we are going to F5 that. <laughs> Yet again, another close one. You can just never be too sure. All it takes is one thing like that, one area of effect in AoE that will just wipe out nearly the whole party. So very good, we're up to level four. And so I can pick another cantrip. I can, I always, chalet. That one is always such a difficult one to pronounce, chalet. It's such an Irish word, I think. Chalet, chalet. Um, people like chalet, I'm not, I'm just not a mad fan of it. I mean, obviously it is good. I'm seeing that when she's up close and let's say she's silenced. It's obviously something you want. It's, you know what, I'm going to take it. It actually is a good one to have. 
Oh, we're on to feet. Okay. This is also going to be another difficult one. Warcaster might be a good one because she has a lot of concentration spells. Yet again, though, Tough is quite good because she's quite squishy as it is. You gain proficiency in tree skills. Eh, sharpshooter. Savage attacker. No, ritual caster. You learn two ritual spells. Resilient. Whole arm. The... The feet I go for normally for my druids is alert. Now that is more down to... How would I say it? Oh, you learn two cantrips. Ah. No harm. Look, let's do that. Do I... Oh, those are all the cantrips maybe available to me now. And produce resistance. Oh, you know what? That's a good one. And I think we get another one, do we? Dispel, you have access to both. Oh, so these are all... Spells require an S... I'm actually very confused. So sorry, you learn two cantrips. And a level one spell from the Druid spell list. You can cast a level one once per long rest. That must be without using a spell slot. Wisdom. I already know that. I didn't know I know that. Good berry. Mm. Animal friendship, charm, entangle, fog. Create or destroy water. Actually, that's always, that's kind of a good one. Healing word. This is a toughie. I... All targets within the light turn visible and hack rolls against them have advantage. You know what? We might go with that. That's actually kind of a good one to have as well. Going to accept that. Uh, sorry, yeah. I generally pick alert for my druids. There is work to do. Well, really, there's only one druid I've gone feet wise with it. But that was more. To do not even with role playing, but more of a aspect of her. She was like very paranoid. But paranoid and more so that she was a protector. Which look Tavi kind of is. I kind of have the same kind of Tavi is based off of my first character. So that's why Yeah, she'd be yeah, I am going along those lines. So the alert was more she's very protective of the group and making sure everyone was safe. So she was very much uh a trap checker, uh, checking surroundings, anything hidden. So the alert was great because it really fit in with her kind of paranoid self of watching out for danger constantly. She couldn't be surprised. So I just, I, I am a fan of alert. I do like it. Oh, so they're all getting their feet. Okay. And... We don't have Produce Flame yet, so I'm going to go with Produce Flame because it's kind of good for, like, even, who would we say, Will? I don't, he seems to be human. I don't think he actually has dark vision. I think I'm happy with, I mean, Silence actually might be a good one to have. But I don't know what that just swapped it out with. I think we're going to take on Silence still. We have two healing spells. Actually, oh, she's gone very... Right, we might throw out something else. She's gone very healing, actually. No, actually, you know what? I'm happy with that. And what? She is a cleric. So there is a cleric one, but let's see what else we have. I'd kind of like to give her something different. Durable... Your constant. Her main thing is wisdom, though. So if we're looking for anything, wisdom might be a good one. Oh, heavily armored. She's a cleric, though. Will she really need it that much? Maybe not. 
Light armoured Lucky. I'd like to just give her something different. Tough. You know what? I might just go tough with her. It might be handy to have. Savage Ritual Caster. Resilient. She kind of gets leveled fairly quick. You know what? Let's make her resilient. You increase an ability by 1 to a maximum 20. You gain proficiency in... Oh, look. I think we're going to go resilient. In wisdom, though. Would she really... No, you know what? I don't know enough about that one to pick it. Let's just go with this. It's just as easy. She'll get some additional health. I'm quite happy with that. Yeah, look, she's gone right up. Sharp as ever. And then in for you. And we'll try to pick a different feat for him as well. So bone chill, friends, minor illusion. Gain advantage. That's probably him. I like Bone Chill. Uh, let's see here. Shatter is nice. Go with Shatter. And... But I kind of like him top it around as well. You know what? I think I would. Let's... Yeah. Let's put that in there as well. No harm in two of them. I mean, if I can have all of them starting ahead of the enemies, it's good for us. Like, we'll not argue with that. Gonna F5 that now. Careful. We're going to group hide. Nice <laughs> Just in case. And we're gonna go in here and see what's around. I think that is all of them taken care of, though, I'll be honest. Can you read? I did click on it. Fine dust coats the pages of this weathered book. Beneath the bone white powder, hundreds of short obituaries are recorded in tiny script. Robin Tipple. Ilmater? Drowning. Ivan Orkinson. Ogma? Internal rot. And Dervin Strow? Stoot? Stoot? Saloon. Fever. Guessing this is their gods and obviously what they died from. Let's have a look in this rustic chest candle. Don't really need a candle, I think we have enough of them. Actually, we'll light this. Ah. Well, it opens something anyway. I am so upset that Wishers wasn't there. I've actually completely forgot about that. So I I actually don't know where we're going to find him. <laughs> After all this. And... Yeah, I mean... Doesn't seem to be really much of interest. The unclaimed... In life. Her service has been impeccable. Daily did she devote herself to the Lady of Loss. Daily did she free herself from the tyranny of memory. All, in time, was lost to her. Her relations, her preferences, even her own name. Upon the altar of her devotion placed she the ultimate offering. Her emptied mind. And when she died... When she awoke in debt and found herself standing in the pale and faded city of judgment, she waited for the Lady of Loss to retrieve her. A million souls and more passed her in colourless gusts, but no hand materialised in her hand. No voice whispered instruction in her ear. No guidance proffered itself from the bleached and barren sky. Time, immaterial time, passed around her like air coming and going, and still, the goddess did not come for her devotee. Kelmover pitied her as much as the Lord of the Dead is able, but could not intervene. This cleric of the Lady of Loss, unclaimed despite her worthiness, 
might yet have one more lesson to learn. That not of forgetting, but being forgotten. Is that Shadowheart? I... It's very, it's very like Shadowheart, like Shadowheart has said that she's had her memory erased. And that she will get it back when she brings the artifact back. That's, ooh, I'm after getting chills there. I think that is about Shadowheart. The unclaimed. Pick up and add to wares, absolutely. That that has to be about Shadow Heart. A cleric? Mmm. And has to go back and learn another lesson. That is it, that has to be. I look with all these kind of games anyway, especially even like Dungeons and Dragons itself, you're always learning. Like, how would you say it? You know, like, secret things? Or there's always clues everywhere that, you know, if you go looking, you will find them. But come on, that has to, that has to be about her. So does she have some link maybe to this chapel then? Let's see if we can find, maybe there's stuff about everyone here. We'll go out and we'll have actually look through here now that I'm not dead this time. Lightly obscured you. That's probably because I am lighting the candles. A quick rummage. Yes. And let's loot all of these. <laughs> I thought it might be... Oh, simple robes. Handy to have. I thought it might be a diary or something she'd been writing. What do you have? Tiger, short bow, nothing really of interest. I probably should stop picking up absolutely everything. Take all of them. I know, yeah, I say I should stop taking everything and it's like, yeah, too lazy to actually read through it all, take it all. What's in here? Now I'm like, is there any other clues? What else are we going to learn? And this... If anyone remembers back to, was it maybe episode two? I could be wrong. Where poor Tavi fell through the ceiling. And this is where she ended up. Back again. I like that. Yet again, there doesn't seem to be anything major in here. I'll take them just in case we decide we want to play dress up at any stage. Mirror... Curse of the Vampire? We'll take that. We know who that's about. Right, I mean, we'll go out here now. See what's around here. Yeah, guys, I don't know where Witters is. I'm assuming, though, in this game, it will give me a few opportunities to find him. So I'm not too upset about it. Yep, may as well take everything. Why not? Bowl. Don't need that. Crate. Don't need that. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be a whole lot in here now either. Yes, dear. It's been centuries since any prayers disturbed it. Ancient, indecipherable text covers the plaque. A dead tongue. Whoever worshipped it must be long gone. Hmm. Do you know anything about a shadow heart? And if I remember correctly, I'm assuming this is going to bring us. Wait, you know, does. Do any of us have a key for that? Better make my next move. No. I can't afford to fail. I can't remember who picked up what, I'll be Eyes honest. Open, what is it? Let's we'll just get him by. Oh, we must be out of lock picks. Stop trying to rob people. Yeah, we must be out. Oh no, I 
actually I do have a lockpick. Let's go. Come on, and we'll add a nice guidance. Oh, look, we <laughs> those of us have guidance now. Go on. I saw Tabby's eyes like light up with the guidance. She, yeah, she gave it to him. Oh, 29. Yeah, very good. That door is destroyed. We're back out there again. So, sadly, no wishers. Oh, do we not take these the last time? Oh, we'll take them now. And a potato. We'll take that. I do think, though, I, I went through all these lads the last time, but now that we're here, yeah, I did think we had. Well, wishers, I mean... Oh, I... I did open it. Is it saying that I didn't? Where... Where is that? Explore the rooms. We found hidden who lies within, but... I'll go back down again. Group height. Yeah, on height. I'll go back down again, but we'll go down the hidden, like this way. But I did, oh, I, I mean, I opened it. I'm after losing it. Maybe it's just the way that I went into it. Oh, what we'll find we out anyway. Dang crypt. Slay. And in we go. So that's lit. Maybe I shouldn't have lit that. I'll unlight it just in case. Let's go back in and try it again. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. These boots have seen everything. Now, maybe it's for... No, okay, maybe it's for Tavi. Don't touch me. I'm sorry, I'd say this is a bug. Let's move. Wits and blades. Because it was. Shot. It when I was running I in, it did have the arrow over, but then when I swapped back to her. Now what might you be hiding? I think this is a bug. Right, so if we all go out here, let's 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 all kind of run away. Maybe, right. I'm just going to see if this will trigger it. Back to herself. I'm going to get them to climb out. To find a way forward. And climb back in again. Maybe it might re-trigger it again. It might be something to do with the fact that I changed it over to Tavi. It wasn't happy with that. For whatever reason. So we'll climb back up. Climb back down. And try do it again. Because I do think it had, like, a little symbol over it. Maybe not, though. And I looked at that plaque the last time. Let's go, guys. Let's see. Here lies the guardian of tombs. Through knowledge comes atonement. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with this. We found a large sarcophagus hidden in the ruins. Who lies within? Hmm. I'm going to just put this down to it's a, what's next? a bug. Right, I'm going to do this one more, one more time, one more time. But I'm going to get, because I know the last time I had Shadowheart talk to him and it worked. Maybe it's something to 
do with the fact that it's not meant to be Tavi that talks to him? I'm not entirely sure. Maybe the party is supposed to be different and made up of different people? Alright, last time. We'll give it a go. Because Shadowheart did talk to him the last time. No, I don't think it's going to do it again either. Let's see what we have here. Look, at least I tried. Maybe when the game is turned off and on again, when we come back, he might be there. Maybe after a long rest. Yeah, that's not working. So we are going to go back to camp and I'm going to long rest. And who knows, then maybe afterwards he might be it's there. Alive, so that's progress. Uh, let's end it. Good time for a chat. No, no, no. I had another dream. Whoever's reaching out, perhaps we truly have a secret protector. I don't know. Leave. Let's try to end the day is and because usually that's when they all want to kind of talk to me. Uh, Gail wants to talk again. What is it this time, my friend? Pretty. Oh. My. You startled me. I, uh... It's miles away. I really want that top so bad. It's so nice. Is everything alright? Of course. Of course. I was just... practicing an incantation. You're a lion. Yeah, I'm gonna insight check you. And can I, yeah, we're going to guidance ourselves. An insight check is if you do not believe something or if you think someone is lying, you can insight check them to see are they lying or are they telling the truth? Just about making it. She does. She's, she's Mistra. I can't quite describe it. The need. I sometimes feel to see her. To draw the filaments of fantasy into existence. No sculpture or painting could ever do her justice. Only the fabric that she herself is and embodies. The weave. Mistra is all magic. And as far as I'm concerned, she is all creation. Sounds like a bit of an obsession, my friend. Uh, yeah, you sound like a smitten schoolboy. It is a kind of love, after all. At the very least, the most deep-seated passion. Magic is... my life. I've been in touch with the Weave for as long as I can remember. There's nothing like it. It's like music, poetry, physical beauty, all rolled into one and given expression through the senses. Would you like to experience this? Would Tavi be interested in this? This is indeed a good question. So, she is druid and she is nature. No, she would probably see this kind of magic as slightly foreign to her. But at the same time, he said it so nicely. Oh. Then follow my lead. Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> What's happened? Now you. Uh, performance. Look, we'll try Arcana. I really hope this is not going to turn weird. <laughs> the look they were giving each other, like, oh no. <laughs> uh, we'll see what happens. But she would like pretty things. I mean, yeah, she's a druid, but like they are kind of magic. But the fact that it was described so prettily, she probably would like that. She'd want to see it.
You feel something strange, like a kind word and a kind touch at the same time. It's warm and comfortable. Excellent. Now, repeat after me. Athra Mistra Real Kantrak Eo. Oh, this is so interesting. You sense power in these words. Oh, okay. Let's try it. Oh, look, she's probably been initiated into some god thing or something. I should have a new patron. Oh, something that we probably shouldn't be going down the road of. Suddenly, the scent of rose water and a sense of well-being. A sliver of weave that tastes sweet on the tongue. Very good. Now, I want you to picture in your mind the concept of harmony. As true as you can. I mean, we're, we're gone this far now, so... Picture... I mean, she would be more... Recall a memory from your use. Is she, look, she's a druid. She'd be more nature. Nature would bring her peace. We're rolling well. I'm not going to argue with us. I mean, we're rolling well, but this could be terrible for Tavi. She could now start an addiction to these artifacts. You see, or is it sense, the presence of a woman. The woman who hovered over Gail's palm. There's something like the anticipation of a kiss. Then the pleasure of being cloaked in peace. You are safe. You are nestled in the cup of Mistra's hand. <laughs> you did it! You're channeling the weave. How does it feel? Uh... <laughs> It feels like it's a good time to call it a night. Uh, effortless. You're a wonderful teacher. Please don't hit on me, Gail. Please, I can't. I can't go through to another interval. Oh, I know. <laughs> He's so happy the with weave himself. <laughs> connects you. The moment feels intimate. No, no, no. Uh. <laughs> Yeah, it's time to let go. The weave evaporates. And as it does so, you realize the night feels suddenly cold and lonesome. Oh. There it goes. How easily things slip away from us. No matter how hard they were in the obtaining. Good night. I enjoyed sharing a moment of magic with you. Okay, Tavi is inadvertently <laughs> uh, having moments with the whole, the whole, the whole party. <laughs> oh, time to go to bed, girl. Yeah, I don't care. Bed. <laughs> There's only so much editing out of these romantic scenes I can do before YouTube is mad at me. Oh. Let's see what happens now. <laughs> I'm scared. Oh no, we're okay. We're okay. That was just a night's rest. Oh! Scratch! You want to talk to me? The dog pants through a ball held firmly in his mouth. I forgot. I do not have... A... I don't have animal... How can I... Attack. <laughs> um, I do not have speak with animals on. Sorry, let's do that. Come back, Scratch. I can talk to you now. The dog holds a well chewed ball in his mouth. And that over. All right. It's only fair that you enjoy it too. But if you feel like throwing it, I wouldn't mind that at all. Item. A 
and leave. But maybe now we can play fetch with him, I'd be assuming. That might be something we can do. But for this episode, that is where we're going to leave things. So I think there was a little bit of a bug in the game. We nearly had Witters. I, I genuinely do not know what's happened there. Look, hopefully in the next one, when we go back there, we can get him. We're after leveling up though, so that's good. Uh, Tabby has touched the weave. Possibly not a good thing. I can see her getting addicted to this. Uh, really, 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 really want Gail's pyjamas. They are so cool looking. Uh, so all in all, a good game. If you like this video, please do give it a like. And if you would like to see future videos by me, maybe give it a subscribe as well. As always, I have a playlist here of all the other videos in Tavi's journey. As always, though, I thank you so much for stopping by and spending this time with me. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.